Today, I'm going to show you how to make your own emergency spare key. Start by holding the original key over a flame. If you're worried about burning your fingers, you can hold it with a pair of pliers. When it's got a nice black coating like this, place it down somewhere safe to cool. Next, we need to take a strip of tape and stick it onto the key like this to take a print. Carefully peel it off and you should have an exact copy of the key like this. Pretty cool, huh? Next, we're going to take the lid from a can of food and lay it on the table. Then take your tape and stick it onto the lid. Then, using a sharp pair of scissors, carefully cut out the key. Do be careful not to cut yourself on any sharp metal and make sure you're nice and accurate, otherwise it won't work. When you're done, it should look like this. And if we hold it up against the original, you can see it's exactly the same. This key was from a padlock, so now I'm going to try it out. It might take a little bit of waggling, but it works just fine. This key is quite a lot thinner than the original one, so do be careful with it. You don't want to bend or snap it. 